Hobbly doobly. This is Unhappy Jester signing in. Uh, now, uh, I'm gonna go play some tea death, team, tea death match? Tea, yes, we're gonna drink tea. No, team death match on solar. Um, personally, I love this map. This is a great map. So, hopefully, uh, I'm able to do some LMG. No, not LMG. What am I saying? Crazy shit. Let's just say that. That that that's actually a nice, nice way to put it. Um, I'm gonna be going left here because this is one of the biggest cluster fucks. Oh, it's like dog fighting that guy. Thank God. That right, guy. Wait for that guy to pop his mug and face out. Um, I like using a three-round burst weapon because, uh, it, it adds more patience to the game. Like, you have to be an accurate shot to use it, and, uh, that's what I strive for. Just try to be accurate all the time. Um, I try to, I try to have the upper hand advantage in distance. Uh, so if that means that I could limit my, uh, uh, my gun capacity like the firing rate to become more accurate and to hit guys at a farther distance then I do it um, that doesn't mean that it's right all the time but this map is perfect for that and I totally missed him um, sometimes I just spam it uh, for uh, uh, for the case of just trying to get the lead out but I think this is an all-around good gun, and will be seen in um, in future gameplays of uh, other other players. Oh. Blood thirst, I'm on. That was the worst Jamaican accent ever. <laughs> so, like how I play is is kind of like. Logistics. I try to take the outside. The outside edges are uh, don't have a whole lot of players, um, but you have the occasional guys that you know do that, and uh, I usually end up dogfighting them. Um, but you know, it's uh, I find it to be uh, less straining than just going straight down the middle. Um, I find it a whole heck of a lot easier and l less frustrating than, you know, just doing that or, you know, finding a good place and just, uh, waiting it out. Um, I don't really encourage camping, but this is, sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do and, like, see, that's just like a clusterfuck. I mean, I don't, I don't like that. So... There's a guy over there. I don't really want to mess up that that area. Kind of, I'll end up like got to get some cover. But I'll go. Uh, I'll go clockwise. See what. Uh, see how this will disrupt the the respawn. Uh, respond on other teams. Oh shit. Oh. That's another thing. Um, like, I don't know. Sometimes the, the mechanics of, uh, of the gameplay, like, how I fell through that window, sometimes, like, my exo catches me, like, for me. Like, I don't even need to, uh, do it and that makes it frustrating sometimes because I want to drop oh well that was just a mistaken of identity right there I thought that guy was alive no but it like sometimes I drop to uh, get out of uh, some guys uh, crosshairs um, and falling through a window uh, that is like like a ceiling is probably the best way to do it because you still have the upper hand advantage because uh, you're now out of the guy's way and you can maneuver back around and 
shoot him right in the ass, but, um, you know, sometimes your exo grabs shit for you, like how it just grabbed that fence, instead of me just hitting the wall and smacking my face on it, but, you know, sometimes it's a, it's a good thing and a bad thing, um, and frankly, I think it's a, it's a nice, it's a nice mix. Gotta get this asshole that's over here. But first, gotta get this asshole. And now I get this asshole. And oh, can't get that asshole. Oh, here comes the spamming. Ah, there we go. See, I don't like that. Uh, like, if I know, like, in the sense of, like, being practical and predictable, I wouldn't, I wouldn't stay there after, like, I was killed twice. And that's why playing on, on the edges are a little bit nicer, because you could check out who's in the interior map, and who's camping, and... You're kind of really testing the waters for like future gameplay and making yourself better and taking out the stragglers, the people that it are not necessarily the best game, the best players, but uh, the ones that uh, that are kind of missing the spawn points and uh, and everything. This guy is trying to clip me. Oh, fuck. okay. Oh. Huh. Get the shit out of here. Fuck you, point blank. Fuck you! Uh, well, you know, sometimes, like, I, I feel like even if I do horribly and then, like, my team wins, it just makes everything go better. It makes me feel better, but even though I had, like, 20 kills and 7 deaths and my team still lost, I just kind of feel like I didn't do my part. And sometimes that's when you have to kick it up to high gear and do what you need to do. But I digress with my random mumbling. And uh, I'll see you guys later. Helen Habajista signing off.